Generic greetings and welcome back once again to another chill session on Townscaper. Today's beverage is naturally a nice relaxing cup of chamomile tea. In the previous episode of Townscaper we were making a lovely looking town. It was very colourful, it had different districts and types of buildings, it had bunting, it had towers, it had some birds on the top of the high uh, roofs and also managed to figure out how to place like a walled garden type area. So pretty good. In this episode we're going to make something a bit different and you've obviously probably figured out from checking out the, <laughs> the video of thumbnail and that's a flying city now i didn't know this was in the game i knew there was many things that are in the game that are sort of hidden however i i've never built a, a flying city but someone pointed out in the comments on uh, roughly how to make it so that's what we're going to try and do now naturally <laughs> it obviously has been successful if you're seeing that uh, thumbnail and watching this but i have not yet made one of these so i really don't know how to crack on with it you need an area that is very round apparently and that looks like a contender and the way you build it is by basically just like building around here and have no harsh edges so that actually wouldn't be acceptable um, but something like this may be but what you need to do is build up a little bit so I'm going to build up one two three four five that'll be fine and then remove all of these and then I want to build around and like I said the idea is to have something that has no sharp edges and then eventually once you connect everything up it should get like a like a sort of floating islandy section and well the fun will be in finding out on this one and oh there we go so once you get <laughs> all of the corners like removed you can then have a floating island and we can see all of that wow okay so that's in um, underneath you've got just the standard paneling there and we can still see sort of the grid and well, it's it maybe is water. Yeah, it's water because there's reflection there. So we have this island. Problem is, it's not very big. This one is it. So I mean, we could do that. Um, it's just a floating warehouse. Okay. Now that we know we can build that, let's look for an area that may be a little, maybe a bit more suitable. So I'm just gonna skirt around and obviously look for, like I say, something that has very. Um, very non-defined edging so we don't want sharp corners like that we want it very round like this but we need to have it so that all of it is round and oh well if that isn't a contender i don't know what is so this should hopefully be a flying island so i'm going to have it as a nice blue color like a sky blue actually make it a little bit darker there and then go one and then that's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and then we're going to delete the whole thing up to the top i like the way you get the ladders in in there as well and let's just build around so i'm placing it and you can see it's sort of automatically flowing around i'm not having to change the the angle of this it's just doing it automatically because of how round it is and here we go and yes we have the floating island now i could connect it straight up through the middle as soon as i put that in there obviously it's going to stop it flying but if i go around like this i'm going to try something a bit different i was just going to go straight across and that is possible however what if i do that and then connect it up here will we get like a, a section section underneath that's all like covered in say propellers or whatever let's see oh hang on Hang on, it's been mistakes here. There we go. And let's just put all that in there. If this doesn't work, we can always redo it and click. Right, that's in and oh, right. So we don't get the propellers, but I'm guessing if I built right across, it would. If we were to do all that, I'm just going to try this. I just want to see what it's like. Um, naturally, building underneath after the fact is a lot more difficult than building it other ways. Let's just see. Oh, there you go. So you do get a propeller there. So you can leave sections out if you wanted to. Yeah, to get the propellers in. You know what? I think I prefer the original one. So I'm just going to use the undo. And undo everything to there. So we've got this like dish underneath essentially. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. So how are we going to go from here? Well, 
there's that in there. That's quite nice. Let's make up. Um, well, naturally, we want a tower, don't we? There's going to be a tower around the outside. That's most likely what's going to happen here. Um, I think we'll have the tower made of like a like a stony type colour. But it's going to go in here. Like that. And then around the outside, I want to have... This is a walled garden, essentially. In the middle. The problem with these things here, these um, floating island things, let's see if it makes up a nice... Oh, it does, but that's not what I've wanted. Um, the problem with these floating islands is that, like, that's it. I mean, I can't really go from there. And if I, if I build further, um, there's not much we can really do. Hmm. See, I don't like that. I could always do that. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and once again, we're back into discovery mode. I quite like that, but if these were a different colour, it would look even better, wouldn't it? But those, if they were green, it would look nice. Oh, yeah, it does look nice. Right, so we'll move those. And these ones, I think, those were red, be much better. <laughs> See, build underneath it just stops the whole thing. Okay, there we go. Um... Oh, if you put them on the corners, they look nice. Oh, that looks even better. Yeah, different colour though. Maybe white. Little white towers on the edge. It's looking very symmetrical though, doesn't it? That's just not what I was after, really. Because we're changing the colour. Obviously, it alters that as well. I don't really want that. Can we connect them up? Will it do something different? Not really. That's an interesting design. <laughs> um, connecting up like that. I don't know if I prefer that. Or not. We get the towers back, I might. There we go. It's not bad. Um, an archway, those. Oh, then we get walkways. Um, I actually think that is better. Hmm, it's still floating, apparently, when we do that. Building on top of that. I mean, that's some structural integrity right there, isn't it? Build just around like that. <gasps> Discoveries! Archway! Remove that, it like... Oh, look at that. It's so nice in there. I think I prefer that. The problem being... <laughs> the, the tower stops, technically, like that. Whereas that is the correct one. Oh, we're doing it like that. Yeah, we'll have it like that. Okay, so we've got another entrance there. Um, if we wanted to, we could... Build there. Or doing that as well. Gives us like little outcroppings. Uh, that's nice too. Mm, don't think I like that. 
In fact, a lot of this maybe was... Maybe less is more. Thor's maybe. And it's similar to what we've done there. Alright, yeah. That's starting to get a decent look about it. I don't know what the deal is there. Um, Maybe like a nice little... There's a, something we can do on the edge to make it a bit different. Those towers. And as soon as you build out a certain size, you're going to get that problem there. I do like that. I think that's really nice. Ooh! Okay. That's worked out. I like the towers again. Not that one. That one. Problem is we are... Getting close to the limit of the tower. I hope they're good engines. <laughs> the problem with anything like this, and like the sort of Avengers helicarrier thing, uh, it's a... <sighs> There's no real failsafe, is there? These break. Um, it doesn't necessarily glide. <laughs> okay. More building, more better. Um, what's it that colour? Yeah. If we move those sections, we get like... We get like that. It's quite nice. Although, if we remove... Mm, no, maybe not. Oh! Move different bits like that. And you get, like, these gardens in there. It's quite nice. What about if we went off? That's it. Ah, that changes that roof to a nice little garden. Uh, like that. Not bad. It's a bit weird. I like that. I like the... Mm. See, if we do that, though, we get rid of these gardens. I like the spikes there. I'm sure there's a way. There will be a way to get that garden back. Oh, you got a garden there. Don't get one there, though. If we connect these up, it looks not as good. Uh, there. <laughs> it's very strange. Which you would sort of expect, being a tower. I prefer the gardens like that. Or that. I prefer the roofs, I think. The fact that they ain't connected up's a bit problematic. There we go, that's better. That's better. Um, some of that I don't like. That's a bit better. Mm, what colour was that? Like an orange? okay. See, it's putting like a bench down the bottom. Oh, I like that. They put these two bits in there. Mm. <laughs> that there looks nice. We put that one. If there's any rain that gets there, it's just going to wash it into the street. <laughs> okay. I want to build up one. Oh, there you go. We get these little archways. And doing that gives another guard. Oh, look at, the, <laughs> look at the way up. You've got these ladders. No, see, it's getting too wide at the top. Which is what I was trying to avoid. Removing that's interesting. There's a look. I think we had it right the first time. Or did we? 
maybe that. I think we need a bit more detail. Around here. Put in those, we get like... Well, there's a garden there, but not here. I wonder why. Bit strange. Residences around there. <laughs> it win. Nice. Okay. Right. I mean, obviously, it's ne it's just we have to build up. That's our. That's just necessity. And like that. Unless we connect that up, we can. Living there is going to be so optimal if you need bread <laughs> or something. Um, yeah, that's a problem. Putting these in um, removes that garden bit that I was after. Oh, well, that's come come out nice. I'm going to change the colour of these, though, to, I think, a bright yellow. Yeah, I do want to bring them down. And do that. Yes, I do. Yeah. One, two, three. Um, get rid of that. Oh, hang on. No. Undo. How was it that? Yeah. One, two, three. Remove that one. That one's just a bit different, that one. That's the front. Get rid of that. That's essentially the front, because <laughs> of the because of that win. Mm. No, don't think that works. I want these towers separate? They're also different heights. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. There we go. That's alright. I'm not overly bothered about if it's symmetrical or not. I mean, it's just getting in there to see what's going on. I mean, <laughs> there's not much that's going to be growing down the bottom because, well, there ain't too much sunlight going to even get that far. Getting up here is also a tiny bit problematic. I can't imagine getting up to there is ideal. <laughs> um, I'll do that. <laughs> yeah. Mm. No. Just it sort of works, and yet doesn't at the same time. I like that you can see through. See through that. I mean, there will be a point where we stop. I think we're reaching that point. Look at that. That's interesting. I do think I want to remove that. Just make it a little bit, a little bit shorter. Oh, anything we put on the side breaks it. <laughs> See, the thing is, we could also build down here. I was thinking of building from on on from this. I was thinking of building like a like a dock. Like, as if this was going to dock up with something, so I'll start building, like, a, a city that also brings up and we'll have, like... Um, well, if this is the front, we'll have to have, like, a... A docking thing here. I don't know how we would build a dock. Uh, we'd have to have an archway, wouldn't we? So if we were to... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, undo. <laughs> have that, and maybe... There's our archway. Yeah, you can see the archway there. Oh yeah, there's the archway. Okay. Oh, that looks nice. Into that. 
and actually don't mind those as well if we do that. Mm. I think perhaps less is more maybe. Just trying to sort of indicate that this is definitely the front. Hmm. I might leave these arches out of the side as well. As soon as we put that in, though, it doesn't work. That definitely doesn't work. Yeah, I like those arches like that. Just see what else we can get going on here. Mm, that did look a bit better. We end up getting rooftop terraces here. There's the front. That's nice. So that would indicate the front. Oh, look at all the birds just sitting on that roof there. <laughs> Are any up the top? No, no, there's nothing at the top. They've, they've, they've totally abandoned the top. They're not too bothered about going up there. Enough's enough. They're hanging around there. All right. Okay. I don't think that's bad. It's an interesting discovery to get these things. And it seems to work out. Let's remove those, we get those again. Yeah, I think I prefer that. I think the roofs give it something extra. But this is the point in the game. This this it literally is its purpose. <laughs> to just build stuff. You're clicking and placing stuff. I think as someone eloquently put it in the comments. And yes, that's nail on head. Uh, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> Hit the nail on the head. Okay, there's our tower. Let's have a quick look um, over on here. Turn the grid off, and you can change like the the colour of it. So you've got your uh, what's this? This is like that's without any shadows by the look of it. All right, fairly plain. That's your standard mode, and there's your shading mode. So we just see the the shading and the lighting. That's nice. But you can also change things like where the sun is, so you can see it's like high up in the sky or not at all. And you can change the direction of it as well. But if you bring it right down, and wait a second, all the lights come on. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's nice. And as the sun rises, I like where the lights just gently flicker on. So it's not as if there's a sensor on the top. And as soon as it goes dark, whoosh, the whole thing comes on. Other noises for electrical connections are available. But yeah, it's it's so... Yeah, it's getting dark and people just sort of... Oh, start flicking all the light switches. Uh, all the light switches or lighting candles or whatever. There you go. Nice. That's our floating... Our floating city. Floating tower. It's like a floating wizard's tower, essentially. Other people could live here as well, naturally. But there you are. I, I still like this ball in the middle. Oh, there you go. So it's got a connection it's got a hard docking clamp there but it's still flying oh that's cool so what we could do knowing that look at that we're still connected we've still got the flying pieces here we still got the flying pieces but we've got this connection as well how about that oh look at that when the pieces fall it all drops in the water what about then if we leave it there for this time this build session and we come back to this to build, like, basically a jetty that comes out and, like, a little supporting city. So we'll have docks, we'll have, like, um, other things here, you know, canals and other bits. And it's as if this has come along and, like, basically this is, like, its landing point. So it lands on here and, like, resupplies, essentially. Is that something you want? If that is something you want, then by all means let me know in the comments we can even make the uh the landing base larger if we really wanted to which would make sense you wouldn't just have a tiny point of contact like that you would have it sort of well basically like that you wouldn't go any further because that would then connect it up but that is like our landing point there where you know it all re it's all it all um connects up i actually i actually prefer i think the struts like that oh that's also quite good either way there's lots of options um if you want to see more townscape let me know in the comments if you want to 
uh, see the construction of that town that I mentioned, then again, let me know. And as always, we will go from there. Hope you have enjoyed this little session of Townscaper. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.